Good Springs has fended off a mob of escaped convicts after organizing an impromptu militia. Yeah, escape convicts. Sadly, I've killed them all so they can no longer spawn new ways for me to get karma easily. I'm gonna fast travel over there, see if maybe just some new ones popped up randomly. Or if they're a like, random encounter over in that part of the map. Or I might want to go do the damn quest I was given that involves mantis eggs. It seems like it should be much easier than fighting those damn butterflies. Yeah? What is it? Uh, a question about your tenants. Like who? Tell me about... Oh, see, I have to talk to all those people first. Can you tell me anything about Anderson? Good man. He's one of the followers of the Apocalypse. He's, part of the He's the one of the top people around here how to start growing crops. West Side wouldn't be what it is without Anderson helping us out. So I cut him a deal on his rent. Dermot, maybe? Roughneck Prospector is all I hear. Good at what he does. Been renting a room here for a year or so. Nothing special. Like who? Guy's unstable, but he pays his rent and Sweetie seems to like him all right. I enjoy telling you about like my who? clients. What do you know about Jimmy? Him? Hmm. Caesar's Legion taught him everything he knows. I bet there's a pound of sand ground into his palms and knees. Knowing Jimmy, I'm sure he took good care of him. I'm surprised he ran away. So I found out he worked for he was with Caesar's Legion somehow psychically. I can't ask about him until I talk to him. But the first time I talk to him, I know to ask him about Caesar's Legion. And this guy here is the one who tells me he worked for Caesar's Legion, even though I can't ask him about him until I logical loopholes here, folks. Like who? Well, tell me about Maud. Oh, oh it's a horrible spin-off based on all the family. Deal of a sweetie, and sometimes you got just enough caps to buy a tough piece of jerky. <laughs> wow, like he's who? a real nice guy. And again, the game does throw in the old lady whore character, and really, uh, when you talk to her, that's pretty much all she's, she is. Ain't so pretty, is she? Not since you had a run-in with those fiends over near McCann. Ah, this fiend cook, ain't cook, 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 on account of the flamethrower he wears. Uh -huh. He had his way with Sarah. Every way it can be done. Uh -huh. Then he starts frying her up for kicks. I guess it was how he signed his work. Yeah, like we ran into him. Uh, I think we need to kill him. All right. See if maybe uh, that will lead to anything useful. Like, you know, just think killing him and then talking to her will uh, provide some kind of plot, or, or maybe it'll just get us uh, some caps out of the corpse of Cook Cook. What do you need this time? Doesn't look like we get to ask her about Cook Cook anyway. Alright. Fine. Mad about the door. I continue to be mad about the Alright, uh I'm gonna go ahead and change my radio station for a while. Don't have a ton of choices here, do we? What is this? Oh god, I thought that's what it was. Yeah, there's not really a bunch of radio stations to choose from in this game. Let's go off the apartments. We find uh, North Sewers, yeah. What's going on in the North Sewers? If that counts, it's like a, is that gonna be a dungeon? Do we need? Is this gonna be like uh, you can't get into D.C. proper? I mean, you can't get into Washington proper, the city itself, without going through the, the sewers. Is that how it's gonna work in this game? Not the sewers, but the subway. Anyway, any rate, I've totally lost track of where it was. I'm trying to find the sewers. Alrighty, there we go. Alright, so let's, uh... At some point I've got to, uh... get organized and decide that I'm gonna go after those mantis eggs. There's all sorts of little quests keep popping up that I'm just ignoring. I am not having a particularly efficient run through this game, I'm sure. 
people who actually know the game well, if they're watching this, would be horrified at how inefficiently I'm stumbling through. But that's what this is, folks. It's a blind, hardcore run. No fair, I just switched radio stations to avoid listening to you. You're on both stations, what the hell? You guys hearing this? Is this just me? I swear to God, it would be on this radio station too if I could receive it here. Okay, these would appear to be like not enemies who are going to kill me, so that's good. Eh, I'm getting irradiated. So where am I actually supposed to be trying to go here? Get really lost in the uh, subway in uh, Fallout 3. Like you can run a really long way before you find out you're going in the completely wrong direction. Ah, but I appear to have found uh, an exit that is not uh, west side, so that's good. Now that I got full health, maybe I need to think about trying to sneak over to that radio station, uh, radio tower place again, uh, that's guarded by a million murder moths. It's Jules and Crandon, the wacky comedy duo. Can I help you with something, stranger? Tell me about North Face. We've been here for a few years, just looking for a place we can call our own. Life's harsh. What is with all these gay male the couples getting together? We've got numbers, we've got food, and we've got trade. That's progress, stranger. We had the two cup black dudes who told us to fuck off and get lost, and so now these guys. Uh, it is Vegas, I mean. Look. What happens in Vegas stays in Vegas, so. Uh, what is it here? Keep your nose to the ground, stranger, that's what. Mind your own business and let us mind our own. Are we clear? If you've got a mind to loot the old H&H &H tools factory, don't even bother. That place is sealed tighter than a rad scorpion's bunghole. Oh, no, Every loose. salvager who tries gets blown up, flattened, or gutted by traps. Then he starts to stink up the town, and we're the ones to clean up the mess. It was over. Okay, so he's... Map marker added. Place you told us not to go. Who are you? Name's Crandon, stranger. I keep an eye out for trouble around here. What kind of trouble? Folks that don't belong. Murderers, rapists, extortionists, and everything in between. Immigrants. You know, oh, sorry. Business as usual in North Vegas, stranger. Doesn't the NCR keep water around here? NCR. Did you just crawl out from under a rock? Those folks only care about their business, their people, and their pockets. NCR's order? Don't make me laugh. Ha! We work this land, we own these streets, and we yank up the bad weeds ourselves. Got it? Um, tell me about your hatred of the NCR. <laughs> Jules, myself, and a few others patrol the streets and sue. Any punks come up out of the rest of the city, we give them the run on. Yeah, I was any trouble. You want to help us out? What makes you think we want you around here, huh? Uh, well, okay, so I got a choice about this, huh? I see I'm m moving up those non-combat skills. I respect your independence and I'm good at taking care of trouble. I've got the skills, the will, and the firepower. All I expect is a decent reward. I'm not interested in this right now. Goodbye. Oh, let's go with speech. That's the kind of stuff I like to hear, stranger. All right. We could use someone like you. What would you have me do, my lord? I, of course, am Lord Death, but... Some squatters decided to take space where they don't belong over by the playground. We'd prefer to keep them off the streets and out of sight. 
Maybe you could go and talk to them. Convince them to see things our way. Okay. I like your speed, stranger. Let me know when that's done. Bye. Someone to watch over me. Okay, so I've got a quest to kick people out of town. That doesn't seem very nice. Are these the ones... Please don't tell me it's these kids. What do you want? I'm Squirtabool. Brandon says you're not allowed to stay here. You'll have to go somewhere else. Oh, really? And how are you going to make us? Not quite there yet. Ah, I'm asking nicely. I only do that once. I'd rather not have any trouble. Here's 50 caps. Yeah, let's do the speech challenge. Hey, hey, don't worry. I was just kidding. We're going, right, boys? Am I going to lose karma for this? I feel like kind of a dick. Oh, well. Doesn't look like I'm. Doesn't look like kicking these people out costs me any karma. Kick them out for a good cause. Pleading this random dude. Pleasing this random dude I just met. Hmm. I see a lot of folks come and go, but none fit your type. None will have your kind of facial hair. Just another wasteland wanderer. Why the suspicion? Because that's the law of the land. You never know when someone's going to stab you in the back. And I like mine upright. Wait, you're back? Maybe one day, stranger, when you've seen all I've seen, done all I've done, you'll sooner trust a rad scorpion than a new face in the wasteland. Rad scorpions have faces. Let's see here. Let's go ahead and have a word with him after... Uh, this game really has a lot of different speech challenges that are not just speech challenges. You have to have, like, gun skill or whatever. I'm kind of digging that. That's not really something that I remember being a big deal in the last game. So, I improve my guns by 20. And then I'll talk to him and try to What's win him mean? over with my incredible gun knowledge. I see you can take care of yourself. Your revolver's trigger shines like silver. You got a sharp eye on you. I take it you like guns, huh? Question is, can you handle more than just a weapon? Can you handle my meat gun? Well, yeah, I'm sorry. Bro, what do you mean by more than just a weapon? I mean, you've got to know yourself before you can truly know the gun. A man so can spend his whole life running do you know before yourself? he realizes he's running from himself. Oh, see, now I could do the survival thing, too. Let's try that out. Why not? Is this guy gonna fucking join me as, like, a, a dude? Who works for me? I think I might be worth a setting. Alright, well, let's uh, go ahead and take. Um, it'd be nice just to have somebody else carrying some shit around for me. Even though I, I do not have uh, high charisma, which means he will not get, like, awesome combat bonuses, but. Alright, uh, survival. See, I knew it was worth it to get survival plus 10. What's eating you? Guns. You got... More than a so weapon. Let's... I do know myself. I'm one with the land. We see eye to eye. We speak warrior to warrior. And I thought myself too old to find an equal. <laughs> you managed to say two things that I liked. Two kinds of folks. You load your gun like an ordinary man, or you load it like a devil. We ain't ordinary, are we? See? I pack good brass up with slow burning powder, then cap it with a heavy semi wide cutter bullet. That's how you make 44 ammo that'll put the fear of the heavens on any wasted that dare cross your path. Okay, so I got a new thingy. Uh, thank you, Jules. Tell me more about you. I thought I was going to get a companion, and I don't mean that in a weird way either. That's a long one, stranger. Let's just say I got tired of killing in the wasteland. Now I found a better home for my old butt. I'm gonna become a male prostitute. But, you see, what do you do here? Outer Vegas ain't exactly a safe place. Despite our numbers, the wasteland creeps through every nook and cranny. I make sure any dangers to the people of North Vegas stay outside our barrier, stranger. Day and night, I stand watch. Could really use some sleep. We're independent folks here. Merchants, gamblers, NCR whores. All of them trade with us, and we offer protection against critters and the fiends. NCR whores? 
You heard me. But I you like, like them. Those stiff back, clean hand little pussies. New Vegas belongs to the people. The NCR is just a corrupt and bloated monster no better than any other wasteland crawler. We make this land wealthy, and we ain't giving it up. Wealthy with our gambling-based economy. What's the deal with the fiends? I mean, I really would like to know what the deal is with them. They seem like just generic raiders in the sense that they just attack everything on sight. They're a bunch of lunatics so pumped full of chems they don't give a damn about life anymore. Fiends rape, kill, and maim for the hell of it. Vault 3's fiend territory. Those shitheads attack Westside all the time, even making it to the rest of Outer Vegas when they crawl under the sewers. Um, go back to my other questions. What's eating? Uh, nah, it's, that's enough. Thank you, warrior. Thank you for meeting me on the plains of destruction. I thought I told you guys to get lost. Piss off. Okay, apparently it didn't work on you. Apparently you didn't get... It didn't work on you either, and you've got the exact same voice as the first guy. Hey, there's more squatters, but... I thought I had, but I guess... I guess I have! That's good to hear. Can't ever be too careful with strangers around here. Got any more work for me? Yeah, I'm pretty good. Moving right on up uh, towards leveling here with all this... Picking locks, passing speech challenges, and bullying people into leaving. Good work with those newcomers. I think you can handle more serious business with more serious rewards. Well, you didn't give me anything for that last one, so. Down in the sewers causing trouble. They ain't packing too much iron, but I'd like them dealt with all the same. I'll deal them. Glad to hear it. Let me know when they're gone. Map marker would be nice, but well, whatever. So, lounge music or country and western? That's our choice in the post apocalyptic hell. So, I'm wondering if those guys would even. I guess they probably would show up. Uh, that's west side. Uh, Alright, well, let's explore the sewers until. Uh, So we find some greasers that we apparently are going to kill because that guy is kind of mean to us, told us to. Okay, so what possible sir this place serves no purpose at all. Great. This is Radio New Vegas, and I'm your host, Mr. New Vegas. And in case you're wondering if you've come to the right oh, place. Oh my god. No longer have super awesome gun and survival power. I'm no longer a badass redneck. Alright, I've pretty much heard this enough. Go straight into the pawn shop. That's interesting. Shake, shake your forbidden parts. Go on, shake, shake, shake your forbidden parts. Shake, shake, shake your forbidden parts. Ooh, yeah. Maybe these greasers down here are uh, the people that were sleeping in the beds before. I think that the guys I'm going to fight will actually be armed and dangerous and I won't lose karma for killing them. Hey there! Hey there, do you do? There he goes. Uh, now we seem to be moving in the direction of deadly greaser enemy guys. Potentially, maybe, who knows. Ah, 
the central sewers. Ah, you see? New area, probably full of all sorts of hostile greasers. I said they were greasers. And then... Those giant rats. Do they count as greasers? Oh wow, I forgot I had the Freddie Mercury mustache. Not really that dangerous, these guys, but... I have gained the animal control perk rank 1. appear to be some kind of uh, ghoul. Yeah, I didn't think the ghouls were hanging around siding with the rats in whatever kind of weird war I've got going now. Yeah, I'm trying desperately to and kill these guys to get karma, apparently. I don't think killing the giant rats got me karma, but I'm back to being very good again, so that was nice. Ready, steady, go. Can't make giant rat steaks, sadly. Man, there's a lot of giant rats around here. Critical on giant rat. Sound like something big and evil was coming up behind me. Might not be that bad, but it sure sounded nasty. Yeah, I think I thought it was like feral ghouls as opposed to just rats. Yay, now, did that, I can kill you with my guns, or, did that earn me karma? What, what did I get karma for? Before. Putting injured rats out of their misery? Not exactly getting a lot of experience for killing the rats. I did not seem to get karma this time for killing the ghoul. Maybe I killed a very special, very evil feral ghoul. He didn't just go around killing people, he went around intentionally killing really precocious children. Alright, let's throw a save out here. And uh, maybe switch weapons to something with a little more accuracy at range. And maybe I can take a couple of shots at these guys. I've got a night scope. Matter of fact. How, how fair you move. So be sure it's true. When you say I love you, 
Running out of patience here. Yeah, it was a great idea if I just shot before he got up and started wandering around. Yeah, I know I'm crippled. I don't even remember what limb I lost, but I do remember losing a limb. Oh, one of my arms. And the other one's almost gone, too. I wonder if you're allowed to even use a gun once both of your arms are crippled. Well, doctor's bags aren't that expensive, it seems like. How many of them have I got? Too. Eh. Here we go. Don't stay. Death, destroyer of rats. Oh, cool! And I can take a shot at this dude if I go just just hold the damn gun steady there. In game avatar. They do appear to have spotted me, though. Okay, time to switch to a different weapon here. This is not going fast enough. Yeah, okay, apparently killing those guys sometimes gets me karma. And sometimes doesn't. I don't know what's going on with that, but... A worn key. Appear to be some kind of boss for this area. Yeah, you're dead. And I got karma out of it too. I guess if there really are lots of feral roamers down here, uh, and they can like access the town from where they are, then getting rid of them probably is uh, would be considered doing a good turn to the local people. Oh, that's really highly irradiated water. I shouldn't have done that. Oh well, now I gotta go back and visit the doctor soon. Together. Let's not wreck this. I forgot to say first. So don't take four attempts like an idiot. Starts? No. Mutate. No. Alright, let's save and mess with this now. Zero of six, correct. So it can't be looted. Oh wait, it can't be looted. Broken. Ah, I really should be using more thinking and logical puzzling here instead of just being like, no, nah, just pick three and then back out and start again. Stages. Close. Ruck. 
not close enough, actually. There we go. See? Logic that one out, folks. Saw a couple things that couldn't have been because they didn't have enough letters in common. Ah, see? Ah, use the old noggin there. Central sewer control. Mouse direction. Oh. I don't know what I accomplished by doing that, but... But hey, a radiation suitcase! Oh, I've been wanting a radiation for a suit for a long time. Advanced radiation suit. Radiation resistance plus 40. Nice! Now I can go fuck around in that irradiated town again, where... The enemies that I wanted to spawn were not spawning anyway, but I wanted to finish that quest and get more um, irradiated NZR dog tags. Since I like finishing the quests as I come across them, you know. But yeah, that I, I totally could have missed that. It's just sitting there. It's not really... Now, maybe the plot was supposed to tell me to come here to find a radiation suit. It seems to be a much bigger deal in this game than it was in the last one. <laughs> 